The Memphis Grizzlies suspend superstar Ja Morant after another gun video appears on social media. More after this. Welcome back to AFG's Point of View, where I give you my analysis on the most popular topics in the world today. In today's video, we have John Morant once again posing with a gun in a video. Before I dive into the details of the video, if you're new here, welcome, welcome to AFG's Point of View. Do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button as well to bring more awesome, loving, and wonderful people over, similar to yourself. All my normal subscribers, thanks for coming back. I'm diving in. Memphis guard Ja Morant has been suspended by the Grizzlies after yet another social media video which appears to be holding a gun. And the NBA is looking to the matter again as well. We are aware of the social media posts involving Ja Morant and are in the process of gathering more information. The Grizzlies said Morant is suspended from all team activities pending league review. The latest video showed Morant in front of a seat of a vehicle appearing to hold the gun while someone filmed him and broadcast it live over Instagram. It is unclear where or when the video was filmed. John Morant was suspended by the NBA for eight games this season after the all-star guard has been seen on the video holding a gun in a nightclub in the Denver suburbs. The league said the suspension was for conduct detrimental to the league. Uh, the suspension cost Morant about $669,000 in salary. Josh's conduct, conduct was irresponsible, reckless, and potentially dangerous. Um, it also has serious consequences given his enormous following and influence, particularly among young fans who look up to him. This is true. Now, this is another one I wanted to share with you as well. As you're very well, you know, I guess, understand that he's a superstar. Most superstars, I don't say most, a decent amount of superstars have their own shoe deal with Nike, Adidas, Puma, you know, whomever, you know what I'm saying? And you know, Josh's no different. He has a sneaker deal with Nike. Um, he just recently dropped his first silhouette of the shoe um, on April 1st. Now here it is, not more than six weeks later, you're in hot water with Nike. Um, I expect Nike to at least pause its relationship with John Morant by tomorrow. Now, you may still be able to go in the stores, grab a few sneakers on the shelf, here or there. Um, but this is the most idiotic thing that I've ever seen in my entire freaking life. You are a superstar. Potentially, you can get a super max contract because you're the best player on the team. Y'all got to the playoffs. Y'all making some make, making some moves. Now, y'all didn't do good in the playoffs. Y'all got bounced by Golden State. But, again, you up and coming. You up and coming. And what do you do? You turn around. And you pose in another video with a gun. Now, granted, I understand Josh is still young. You know what I'm saying? We look at these guys like they're grown ass men. Yeah, they're grown ass men because of their age, okay? But mentally, they still young. They still little boys and they do dumb stuff. Apparently, the NBA is looking into this and they should be because if I was the NBA, the first punishment that they gave of eight weeks wasn't good enough. I kind of feel like you need to suspend him for the year without pay, okay, to send a message to him. Yo, bro, you missing the bag up. You messing the bag up big time. Now, as Father T, um, T Morant, you know, you got folks that's from the streets, you know what I'm saying? 
So that street life is in the kid, you know what I'm saying? There ain't much you can say about that. But you can have street life all in you, all up and down, all you want. What I'm not about to do is mess that bag up, okay? I had a bag from getting to the NBA. Now I got a bigger bag because now I got a shoe contract. I could have had a bigger bag because now I can get more endorsements. You see what I'm saying? The same? So when you posing on there with guns and then kids seeing that, then they want to run around and do all that kind of stuff. And they run around here shooting and doing all kinds of stuff. Like, come on, dude, you're drawing now. You don't want to be part of that, you know what I'm saying, that scenario. I don't understand why everybody feel like they got to be a fucking thug. You know what I'm saying? Or a knucklehead, you know what I'm saying? Just to get the respect of the streets. Fuck the streets, okay? The streets ain't did nothing for nobody, okay? And I see a bunch of niggas out here dying in the streets. And guess what? Who got your back? Not one of them dudes that you sitting there posing for in the streets, okay? Ain't nobody gonna take care of your family. Ain't nobody gonna look out for you, you know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody gonna do nothing that's gonna benefit you. It's gonna benefit them in the long run because all they wanna do it's feel like, hey, we doing this, we doing this, we doing that. You know what I'm saying? Oh, my man looking out for me on this and that. Like, you ain't got to keep up with all them dudes. You don't have to keep up with them. You're supposed to be this. You're supposed to set the example for them where they need to get to. You want to call me corny? By all means, I'd be the corniest nigga on the planet. Okay? I don't give a damn. I ain't about to mess the millions up. It ain't about to happen. They got a family to take care of. Okay? And that's longevity family to take care of. I'm talking about my kids should never have to work a day in their life. They can run their own business because daddy came through, did what he needed to do, drop a couple dollars and they, you know, and build that money up. But daddy want to be a thug. Daddy young, daddy want to be a thug in the streets. What he needs to do is get them people that's in his circle out of there quick. He needs some people that's going to talk some sense in his head and let him know this ain't the way. This truly ain't the way to go. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm disappointed in John Morant. You know what I'm saying? He got to do better. Great basketball player, but he ruining it big time. You going to mess around and get tossed out the league. You know what I'm saying? Last person we saw with a gun, all crazy like that, Gilbert Arenas. You know what I'm saying? I'm quite sure other basketball players had guns and all that kind of stuff. I'm sure they all got guns. But they're not on Instagram. Posing with them. Doing all the dancing and all that. Like, come on, man. Start using this, bro. Start using this. It's embarrassing. But with that being said, if you like what you've heard, please don't hesitate to hit the subscribe button down below. Hit the like button as well to bring more awesome, loving, and wonderful people over. Similar to yourself. I'm on my normal subscribers. Thanks for coming back. On my new subscribers. Welcome. Welcome to AV's POV. Do me a favor. Hit the like button. Hit the like button. Hit the like button. Do me another favor. Head on over to TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube Shorts. Give me a like, give me a follow, subscribe. And um, I keep this content rolling for you. You know what I'm saying? So with that being said, I love every single one of y'all. And I will see you in the next video. Peace.